All right, Coach, if you would, just start by opening up on your thoughts on today's game. Um, I would say my initial thoughts is that first I want to congratulate Flatford University. I think they had an excellent game plan. Um, they played a, a good ball game and pretty much beat us on the board. So I guess uh, just starting off with my initial thoughts is just that uh, it, the game pretty much came down to free throws and rebounding. We weren't able to make some critical free throws at the end, or throughout the course of the game, I should say. And uh, rebounding uh, was pretty much non-existent. You know, looking at the stat sheet, we pretty much got rebounded by ooh, 58 to 29. And so uh, whenever you're in a position like that, where you're getting out-rebounded by that many, man, it's going to be tough to beat any team. So. Coach, you talked about this back coming up This season has been about just competing. You know, when I first accepted the position at the point, my biggest thing was I wanted to make sure that we kind of change the program and the mindset. You know? So I understood that it would be a process. And, uh, myself and the coaching staff, we took it upon ourselves to make sure that we put our players in a position to compete. And so um, in that light, we understood that it was going to be a process throughout the season. And, if you look at our, our first game and compare it to today, you know, a lot of people would say, including myself, we would say that we've gotten better as a team. Now, of course, we want to be a little bit better because maybe that changes the outcome of this game. But I think uh, me being the first, well, with me being my first year as a head coach of the morning and then, you know, having a young team, I'm very proud of the fact that they stuck together and that they trusted in our program and in our system. And, um, I think that with this experience over the past couple of games or the past, you know, season within itself, uh, I think this experience will make them better and more mature for the future. So, uh, but it was a definitely a learning process, not just for myself, but for the players as well. Coach, uh, Lakers came out and said that you Um, at that particular point, I was trying to get them to execute on both ends of the floor, and particularly uh, defensively. I was trying to keep our energy up on the defensive end. So uh, I pretty much, you know, gave them their assignments, and they did a great job executing. But I, I want to say, in that, that span that you're talking about, we didn't execute offensively like we should. You know, so we went on the drought offensively, but defensively, you know. Uh, I think you know we met our responsibilities. We rotated quickly, and they just hit some big shots. You know, um, and, and I think it was number twenty-two. I think she hit yeah three trays. She went three for three for eight from the uh, three-point line. And, I mean, we wasn't expecting that, but but hey, uh, I think that's where that was primarily the difference of the game. She hit some big-time momentum-changing type shots, and. Even though we played defense great for 28 seconds, she would come down and hit that shot, and that would just hurt us. So, uh, I don't know if that answered the question. Okay. I know it's early. Yeah. Game just ends. See, we're in Looking forward to the season. What do you take from this experience, and what do you tell me what you did experience? Looking forward to the season. One thing that I mentioned to the young ladies in the locker room was uh, I wanted them to remember this moment. Uh, I wanted them to, you know, be reminded of it every time that they do a workout over the summer or when they do preseason conditioning, you know, because uh, I want them to feel uncomfortable. And so this loss needs to be a lesson learned. And if you don't want to be lesson learned as a coaching staff, as a team, then it was the loss was done in vain. So I'm trying to make sure that we did a good job, an okay job this year in terms of setting the foundation, but we got to do some things differently if we want to do it ourselves. Uh, at this point, you know, again, I am very proud of my team. I am a very young team. We only have one senior, a lot of freshmen, a lot of sophomores on the team, so I'm, I'm proud of the effort that they gave. Uh, another thing I mentioned to them in the locker room was that.
that, you know, a lot of teams would have bailed out, you know, in the middle of the season, you know, through a tough stretch. A lot of teams would have checked out or went somewhere else, but they stuck with it. You know, uh, they made every game competitive. Uh, they, they did their job. And so I'm proud of the fact that we accomplished some things as freshmen and sophomores that I hope that we can get better at next year as, you know, juniors and sophomores and seniors. That's the only thing I have to say. All right, thanks, Coach. All right, thank you. Thank you.